your watching gears. Brought to you by LMC Truck. Keep them on the road. Hey, welcome to Gears. As you can see, we have made some great progress on this old 86 long bed Chevy truck that started out life as a farm truck before we blew it all apart and created the stunt double out of it, a modern version of the old Fall Guy truck. Now, as you can see, the body is all together. We've hooked up all the major components under the hood. Now it is time to put a face on this thing and finish out the front end. The first step is to fit the headlight buckets, and those fasten to the core support with special springs and screws. Now, if your original parts are in good shape, you can clean those up and reuse them. If not, replacements are available from LMC. Now, when you're fitting your headlights, you're going to find that these little plastic adjusters are notorious for breaking or pulling out. It was just a bad design. They were always a problem. Now, you can get replacements, but that doesn't really solve the problem. What we're going to do is do away with the plastic inserts and replace it by riveting in a metal insert that we got from ARP. This will give us a permanent solution to a long-standing square body problem. Now, when it comes to the headlight buckets and the trim rings, chances are you can clean those up, repaint them, and reuse them like we did here. But obviously, if they're rusty or all bent up, you need to replace them. For headlight bulbs, you can go with a stock style sealed beam bulb or a more modern light with a removable halogen bulb. Now, since this is a more traditional looking truck, we're going to stick with the stock style bulb. 